Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel. And for those who are joining us for the first time, welcome, welcome, welcome. Today's video is sponsored by LiftMaster. We're gonna tell you guys all about them here in just a little bit. But first, why don't we check out what we have been up to lately? Whoever brings it back to me is the winner. <laughs> Go get it. So the boys are on an adventure and me and Thomas are sitting on our new chairs with a view and we're throwing a ball with this. <laughs> and the birds are uh, making pretty music for us. We're trying to get all the energy out of the kiddo. So, so they'll go down sleepy, sleepy. Mm -hmm. Did you get your ball? Yeah, we go. Oh yeah. Okay. We sent the boys on an adventure to go find the ball. But little did they know, I had it behind my back the whole time, but we told them to go find it so to get some energy out. And what do you know, three minutes later, they're back. Did you find it? I think Sissy did. Oh. <laughs> yeah, his face is like, I hate you. <laughs> house is very noisy today. It is the weekend. PJ is playing with the kids up in the playroom. So sorry if you hear them. That's just our life these days. We don't mind that much though. Like I mentioned, this vlog is sponsored by LiftMaster and they helped us do something really sweet for my mom that I've always wanted to do for her because ever since she first moved into her house 11 years ago, her garage doors have been the loudest clunkiest, they sounded like a freight train every time you open and close them. And LiftMaster installed brand new motors on both of her garage doors. Can you hear the kids? Now they are so quiet and it has made all the difference in the world. But besides them just being super quiet, there's also so many really neat and amazing features on a LiftMaster motor that we had no idea about and that my mom has really, really been taking full advantage of lately. LiftMaster is introducing the first ever garage door opener with a built-in 140 degree wide angle camera that lets you see pretty much everything in your garage. So you can keep tabs on it and it gives you a real sense of security, especially whenever you're not there. Another neat thing is there's two-way communication so you can speak through the camera. We went with a local company here in our town to install the garage doors and they were so helpful. They were so efficient. They're an authorized LiftMaster dealer. They were in and out super quick. Everything was done the exact same day. I thought it was going to take a lot longer to install, but they made it happen super fast. And they showed my mom how to work her MyQ app, which is the app that you use to control all of the fancy smart home technology that comes with the LiftMaster motors. Another neat thing about the MyQ app is you can open and close your garage door from the app. So my mom was telling me how she was just spending all day playing with it like a kid in a candy shop. She was opening and closing the garage door from her living room. She didn't even have to get up off the couch. Oh, another cool thing is the battery backup. So the built-in battery backup system enables the opener to work during power outages. So you can still get in and out in case of an emergency, which is really, really cool. You can actually share access to be able to open your garage door through the MyQ app with the MyQ guest feature. So you can let up to three additional people have access to it without giving them your password and they can actually open your garage door if you ever need it. So like your dog walker or if someone's watching your home while you're out of town. Oh, one of my mom's favorite features that she has been talking about. The MyQ technology provides Amazon Prime members with the option for free in garage delivery through Amazon Key. So you don't have to worry about packages going missing or getting wet. So once again, we wanna give a huge thank you to LiftMaster for sponsoring this video and for helping us do something for my mom that we've always wanted to do. If you wanna learn more about LiftMaster, you can check out the information in our bio. Thomas is making me watch Good People and it's good awful. Good people, it's called normal people. It's awful. Well, we're trying to stay awake to midnight because mm. Taylor Swift's new album, Folklore, is coming out at midnight. And I've heard some really good things about this show. There are awful things about it. Why don't you like it? I don't understand. It has beautiful interiors. The main guy is really cute. You don't think he's that cute? No. 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 No.
cosas. No. 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 I'm going to bed. I'm not. I'm staying up till midnight. And maybe even having popcorn. So far, I've had two Oreo cookies, a bowl of cereal, a bag of popcorn, and cheese it. Oh, shoot. Um, sorry. You sound like Cher from um, Clueless. You know what I'm talking about? It's, it's actually midnight 01, 12.01. Midnight 01? What's that thing? It is right now. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, good lord. Go to Instagram and see. Did she lie to us? What am I missing? I didn't... The way I was reading it sounded like it had to be bought. I stayed up until midnight for nothing. So, you know, it's not on iTunes either. Whatever. Okay, so we are currently over at the cottage and it's been a while since we have given you an update so we thought we'd kind of walk you through what we've done. So all of the sheetrock is installed, which is awesome. I started installing the crown molding and then the trim around the windows. And then I came over earlier today to sand the floors in both bathrooms. It's got a plywood floor, but there's a polyurethane on top of it. And the person who was doing the tile told us that it had to be sanded before he could put the waterproofing membrane down because it wouldn't adhere to the subfloor if we didn't sand it. So I sanded that today. They're supposed to start getting the bathrooms ready for tile tomorrow. So it'll be like over the next few days they do the tile in the bathrooms. We got a quote for kitchen cabinets. We've actually gotten three quotes for kitchen cabinets. They range anywhere from, well, two of them came in at $8,000 for custom cabinets. And then we found another guy that will do more of like a box cabinet with some custom features that should be cheaper. I don't have that quote back yet. Well, the cool thing is this is the first time that I'm seeing the fruits of PJ's labor <laughs> in a while. Yeah. So the PJ did the, he mentioned he did the trim. So the window directly in front of us is all trimmed out. It looks beautiful. That was the first thing I saw whenever I walked in. And I was like, <gasps> PJ, that looks so good. Yeah, I can't wait till all the crown mold and the trim and the door trim is up. But we thought that we would come over here and give you an update, obviously, we still have a long way to go, but it's, no. it's slowly getting there. It is, you've made so much progress. PJ will sneak off here during the day and knock out a few hours over at the cottage. And it's always fun for me because I get to see what he's been up to on little site visits like this. So this is, mm -hmm. I'm gonna like peek around each room and see what's different and what's not, but it all looks so good. Thank like you. so good. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, go back. So because the tile is happening this coming week, we have to pick it out. We know that we're gonna do a subway tile for the shower just because we already have it and we wanna use what we have, but we need tile for both floors and we'll just go with the same tile for each. I'm gonna go in and pick out a few and take photos and then Thomas is gonna do the same and then we're gonna compare. Good luck. Thanks. So I just went in and picked my favorites. Now Thomas is gonna go in and take photos of his favorites. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Thank you. Here we go. I know. Alright, so it's lunchtime. We're having lip 
leftover baked spaghetti. Yum. One exciting thing that we've been working on the last two days is we did a conference call with Instagram with a lot of other people. Yeah, we were not the only ones yeah, there making us sound so much more. There were thousands. <laughs> but anyways, but anyways, Instagram is launching a new platform. Is that what you need to call it? Platform. Maybe it's like a feature. A new feature. And it's called Instagram Reels. So we have early access to it so that we can start working on it. So you have your regular feed, but now this is a new feature. This is the Instagram Reels feature. So it's basically like making short videos, kind of like other apps you're aware of, <laughs> but they're 15 seconds. And it's really fun because you can, like this one we did, which you guys will see. Couples challenge personality edition. Who's funnier? So you have to watch it on, on Reels. Ooh, teasing. Reels will be live by the time this video is live. So if you haven't checked it out yet, you'll have to go see because we have, I think right now we have 20 videos that are already shot and edited, uploaded and ready to launch. Um, so we're really excited about it. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of fun. The main thing that's fun about it is like it's completely changed how we create content. For these videos, we're doing a lot of educational how-to, whether that be like flipping houses. Um, Thomas did a salad dressing recipe. I did an at-home workout. We did learning uh, type stuff for the kids. So it's really fun. And they have to be 15 seconds or shorter. So it really pushes you to get all of the content in that 15 second thing. We're doing a recap of the cottage makeover that we're doing and I think I'm up to like part four now, but it's going to walk you through the steps of renovating or flipping a house. Which is great because I feel like we've been working on it for so long that it's myself like, included is like, wait, where are we? So it kind of puts it all in a linear yeah. timeline. Yeah. And I mean, if you are interested in renovating properties, it also walks you through like a step-by-step -step to like what to do first, what to do next, what to, and then like all the mm -hmm. way through. Obviously we're not finished with the cottage yet, but we'll continue these videos throughout the end and maybe even put them all together. But yeah, yeah. lots of fun. It's I been, know. we've been very busy the last two days, but I cannot wait till it launches to see like everybody's content. So, cool. Yes. Let's eat lunch. Lunch time! What, baby? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Johnny, Johnny. Yeah, Baba. Eating sugar. Yeah, Baba. Telling lies. Yeah, Baba. Open your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so PJ is about to leave to go pick out the tile because the tile guy is coming tomorrow. Tomorrow, right? Yeah, so he's gonna install the tile at the cottage for the floor. He's starting with the floor and then he's gonna do the showers. So I have to get all of it today. That's so exciting. But speaking of renovating and design, we just realized that we never showed you guys the playroom reveal. We teased it a couple of weeks ago and we finished the playroom and a couple of you mentioned that we never showed it to you. I don't know, life just happens sometimes. So here is the playroom reveal with some nice music behind it to really feel playful. Mm -hmm. feel... I don't know. <laughs> to really draw you in.